Greetings, thrill seekers, music lovers, and conversationalists all across the fruited plain. How is everybody doing today? We had some technical difficulties there. Uh, we lost power. And uh, our backup generators did not kick in here at Southern Command. I think it's a plot. Uh, somebody doesn't want the, the news of what I'm about to say today to get out there. They're trying to silence me. So if you find me missing... Uh, please go look uh, for me next to Jimmy Hoffa. Uh, so you'll, th that's where you'll find me. Just an FYI. How's everybody doing? How's everybody's weekend? I spent my weekend out just uh, towing some cars back. There's uh, certain cars, if you haven't heard about it, they got this thing that you can steal. It's a screwdriver. It's a little bit more complicated than a screwdriver, but it is as simple as a screwdriver. And, well... I had to go pick up a car all the way in H-Town, or Houston, as you may call it. Uh, yeah, the, well, that, that place is just uh, not one of my favorite cities. Yeah, let's just avoid that place. No. So for everybody out there in Houston, if I offended you, well, stay offended, because you ain't getting no more apologies from me. Yeah, that, that place I've never liked. So oh, anyway, so that's what's happened there. We're right here on the forefront. Uh, let's uh, just doing uh, doing our thing here. We're going to bring you, of course, some good music. Uh, the NASCAR championship was this weekend for those three people out of those millions out there that are interested in all of the uh, southern United States. Oh, but not just the south anymore because now we got NASCARs like everywhere. You know, Jeff Gordon helped uh, help bring it to the general public because he's because he could actually enunciate his words. Well, this is what NASCAR used to sound like. And then they'll go out there, you know, they'll get their turn three, you know, got real squirrely, you know, we ran him up my back. And, uh, you know, we're pretty good, hunted, strong wind, you know, carburetors were going pretty good. You know, got the tire, got my pitch stop in. And, uh, you know, he got, got control, but he kind of squirrely there at the end. And, you know, and so, you know, that's what, you know, most of it used to be like. But then this young man by the name of Jeff Gordon came in, and he came in, and he was like, yeah, I got my car really set up, and, uh, you know, I took it into turn three. I was a little loose, so we made some adjustments on pit road. I got a gas, uh, you know, some fuel in, and we went back out in track, and we came in first place. So, you know, he could actually enunciate his words. So uh, for all you Southerners out there, yeah, man, y'all need to learn to speak some English out there. Well, well, you know, do you think everybody speaks like a water Texas out there or something like that? You know, why would we even mention water Texas here on radio? All right, well, you know, that's how it goes, you know. But when I say Southern Command, yes, we are in the South. But uh, I guess we are part of the South. But we don't speak like it. All right, so we got a show for you coming up. We got, uh, for all you veterans out there, we got Veterans Day coming up. Because everybody knows why we joined the military. So we can get that discount at Applebee's. Whoa. You're listening to Vaquero Radio, the Valley Student Station. This is the Rock Hour with your DJ, DJ Z, the Rock Ambassador. How's everybody doing this afternoon? I hope okay. I know I'm doing pretty good. Just doing awesome out there. Take a break from your work. Just, uh, if you're out there working, just take a break. If you're at school in class, just uh, get yourself a favorite beverage. Hey, uh, yes, I'm downing them down here at the station, and you should down them wherever it is you're at, too, your favorite beverage. Uh, we were just talking about uh, some coffees and stuff earlier this morning. If you're into that kind of thing, I know I am, and uh, other beverages as well. But, uh, yeah, this is the quickest hour all week long. I know you've been sitting there waiting six days and... 23, 24 hours, because we had an extra hour on Saturday. How was that extra hour of sleep? Was, oh, man, it was great. I'll tell you that much. And I know I've gotten old. Used to be when I was young, let's say like when I was uh, 30, maybe even 40, that, that extra hour is like, yeah, an extra hour at the club. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And now it's like, uh, yeah, you know what? We got an extra hour of sleep. Let's stay home and... Uh, Get that extra hour. Yeah. No. Wow. Yeah, time changes. I, I, I got the producer. He's on the other side of the glass, and he's laughing at me. And, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, some of his cohorts are. Yeah, she's she's back there giggling, just laughing. 
Yeah, that uh, live it up, guys. You know, laugh it up, laugh it up. I want, I want to see you looking as good as I do when I, when you get to my age. Yeah. So, uh, uh, did challenge? They, they say challenge accepted. They say we got Botox and plastic surgery nowadays. So uh, I, I, they just might do that. They just might have an edge on me. I'm not doing any of that stuff. Anyhow, how's everybody doing? What day is it today? Well, uh, today is Monday, November the 6th, 2023. Today is Job Action Day. I don't know what that means. Um, I guess go to work and do something. Besides what you normally do. So, I, I guess be productive today. National Nachos Day. Perfect thing to enjoy that favorite beverage with. Speaking of which. Man, I, I got a bunch of them here in the, in the fridge here. Uh, it's stashed away. Color of the World Orange Day. I guess that means. Why? Because this is Vaquero Radio at UTRGV, the Valley Student Station. We, you know, orange is our color. So, color of the world, orange day. That's that's what today is. Dog Film Festival Day. Oh, I guess. I, I guess. And, and National Michel Day. And it, you have to, uh, you know, say it, you know, fancy like that. Michel. Uh, I, I don't know. I'm not European or Italian. I, I can't say it all fancy. If you can, great. National Saxophone Day. So I guess people like uh, Riker from Star Trek and the real life figure, uh, uh, Bill Clinton, uh, I think he could play the saxophone. I think he even played it once at, uh, what was he doing where he played it? I don't know, some big event party thing and and uh, Slick Willie there came out with a uh, saxophone, and I guess he he wowed the crowd with his saxophone prowess. I guess. Boy, I, I tell you what, that 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 Hillary's one lucky gal, huh? <laughs> well, today is also Emma Stone's birthday. Yeah, Emma Stones. It, it, it's her birthday today. You know the the one from Spider Man, the one with the Garfield Spider Man. No, not Garfield, the cat, the something. I don't even know his first name, but he he was one of the actors. And uh, there's a big old thing with the Spider Man. Are you like a a Garfield guy or? Oh man, what was that other guy's name? I I completely fought, for, forgot his name. He he he's the old guy though. Now well now he's old. Uh, dang, what's his name? I don't know. They came out in the in the, in the Spidey verse thing. All three Spider Mans came out, which was pretty cool. If you if you saw that movie, it was uh, No World for Tomorrow or uh, I don't even know. I, I I used to just keep better track of all the movie stuff and things like that, but that I don't. So oh, today is also Sally Field's birthday. Speaking of S- Spider Man, she was in Spider Man. With the, the Garfield uh, uh, movie. So, wow. Hey, what a coincidence. So was Emma Stone. They were all in that Spider-Man. Wow. You know what? That's that's pretty amazing. Of course, I knew already. Because I have here in my formerly staying nicotine hands uh, the notes. So, I'm just bringing you those interesting tidbits. Yeah, that's, uh, that's what I do here. And, uh, and and we also talk rock, which I, I got some stuff here for you. And we'll get that in in the next segment because, but, you know, we do have to hurry it up because this is the fastest hour in broadcast all week long. It's already 1.32. We lost some minutes there, which were very valuable and precious minutes to that power outage. So, uh, well, since those power outages are not happening today, well, let's get into... Uh, I guess more of uh, more of the music, which you're here to listen to as well. You're listening to Vaquero Radio, the Valley Student Station. How's everybody doing? Enjoying the music, I hope. I know I sure am. And just got to open another favorite beverage up. I hope you're out there drinking your favorite beverages, listening to the show, taking a break from your studies. Yeah, like you ain't going to do that assignment to last minute anyway. I know you too well. Yeah, it was Fortunate Son by Creedence Clearwater Revival. Before then, it was Soldiers by Otherwise. And of course, UV, UVU by The Hue. 
that Mongolian band, the people that brought us Genghis Khan. Uh, is it Genghis Khan or Genghis Khan? I don't know, but I am sitting in the Attila the Hun chair. So uh, that's, yeah. wow, just, man, Genghis Khan, what an awesome general. It's just, or Genghis Khan, what, I, I don't know. Uh, uh, what's that guy's name? Something Perry. He, he, uh, uh, he, he used to call him Genghis Khan. Uh, he he was in Vietnam, by the way, for those that don't know. Uh, uh, yeah, for those that don't know. And if the Hue, speaking of the Hue, oh, gosh, man, um, they, they have done so many collabs with people. Uh, uh, Wolf Totem by Jacoby Shaddix of Papa Roach. And uh, they got a, a new one out. If you haven't heard it, just go to the YouTubes. But they do have Black Thunder with, uh, a, again, featuring uh, Tankin and DL of Bad Wolves. And that is one bad freaking song, the Black Thunder. It's, it's a good one. Uh, let's see. We've told them, uh, UV, UV, U, the one we just, uh, well, the one we just heard, they do have one with Ashes to New. That is a really good one. Uh, that's we. I don't have that one, otherwise I would have played it, but that's a really good one. And they also have one, uh, let's hear, of Alice in Change. This is Mongol Warrior Souls with William Duvall from Alice of Change. So that, that one's pretty good. And, of course, they also have uh, the Song of Women Feet. That is an awesome song. And that is done, of course, with the fabulous Lizzie Hale of Hailstorm. So, yeah, they've got some pretty good uh, music out there, and uh, it's just uh, lots of collabs. Uh, Lizzie Hale just did one with Gore. It was uh, freaking awesome. She came out there and, of course, all Gore attire, you know, the big giant platform shoes that made her about 12 inches taller, and with, uh, you know, horns and the whole armor and the spikes sticking out and the belt and Ah, dude, it's just awesome. Uh, so she did recently did all that with the, with Guar. So uh, not bad. Lizzie Hale is out there doing lots of stuff uh, on her uh, own as, as well. Speaking of the rock world, and I have to be quick because this is the fastest hour in rock all week long. Um, Ace Freely, of course, he's going. He's the lead guitarist for Kiss. He's putting out a new solo album that he says is going to make Paul Stanley look like an idiot. So, uh, it's just hard to believe that, you know, Paul Stanley needs help in, in doing that. So, uh, I don't know. I, I guess go for it, you know, uh, Ace Freely. Green Day is coming out, oh, you know, with their new uh, uh, Savior Tour across America. I guess they had conflict of interest there. They were going to call it the I Hate America But Love Money Tour, but instead went with the Savior Tour. Uh, yeah, I guess that other one was kind of counterintuitive. Uh, just like Rage Against the Machine, you know. Yeah, Rage Against the Machine. Yeah, we use the machine to make our money. So, uh, yeah, whatever. I, you know, it's counterintuitive there. But, hey, they got good music. Uh, what else can I say? Uh, oh, by the way, everybody knows. I know you're all college students out there. And some of you that aren't have been single or poor veteran military guys out there. That you notice the theme where I'm trying to play lots of... Uh, uh, military-oriented type uh, songs there, you know, uh, uh, CCR, Fortunate Son, you know, come on, it's like one of those things where it's just any war movie has that song in there. So uh, let's see here. Uh, the company that, that does the noodles, ramen noodles, those little cups in a bowl, well, they just came out with a bowl that you can stick in the microwave. After 50 years, you have a microwave of bowl ramen noodle cup. And for if, if you're like me, I didn't know you weren't supposed to stick those things in the microwave. Man, I, I mean, wow, news to me. Who knew? Join that last beverage before I have to go. It is that time of day. Unfortunately, I have uh, the, the producer. He's 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 looking at me, uh, waving his arms vigorously, pointing at his watch, saying that oh, he's got some papers. 
Um, failure to follow radio procedures. You have one hour. Um, yeah, he's telling me I need to sign it or something. I'm not too big on paperwork. I don't know what he's talking about, but, um, yeah, I, I know what time it is. I have a watch too. Mine's beautiful. See it? Uh, yeah, he's now he's, he's banging on the glass, uh, you know, trying to get me to stop it. Uh, we got a show after this. No, we don't. Uh, there's nobody banging down the doors, but if there was, uh, they'd be banging on the door. He's, uh, yes, I know. I know what time it is. Yes, daylight savings time. I, I know, I know. Oh, well, yeah, they're looking at me. Thank you, everybody, for listening. And I have to go get to the, I have to go to the principal's office to sit down to listen to them lecture about going beyond my one hour programming. Uh, you all still need to come out here and protest in front of the station and demand and have riots and knock over the, the little hot dog stand outside and knock the tables down and demand that I'm here three hours a day every day in the Attila the Hun chair. That's why I'm still here. Okay, anyway, thank you for listening. Greatly appreciated, and I will leave you today with Love Guns uh, by Kiss. So, uh, remember, tomorrow, quick note, go vote. Lots of things for you in Texas on the Constitution, so go vote. And uh, those of you not in Texas, uh, who cares? We, we don't care about your state. Hey, everybody, have fun. Thank you. Enjoy that last beverage. For all you veterans out there, happy Veterans Day. Do push-ups until I get tired.